Hi, my name is Rich Van Buskirk. I'm an Associate Professor in Environmental Studies. For the past couple of years, I've been working on American kestrels. That's one of our falcon species here in North America. In fact, it's the smallest falcon that you can find in the U.S. And this little bird's pretty common around forest groves, so it makes it a real ideal study species to work with. This past summer, I had a team of two students who joined me to go out and capture birds, ban them, and in this case, for the first year, we outfitted them with radio transmitters. This allowed us to relocate them relatively easily. What we're primarily trying to do is to get a sense of where the birds live, where they go to hunt, and then how successful they are at producing offspring. And this will tell us a lot about the quality of the habitat here around Forest Grove. And these bands have lettering that's large enough that allows us to be able to read them once the bird is released from a distance. And when we come back in that same area, we can use our spotting scopes to be able to read that number and identify individuals. So students who come in to do this sort of work, um, they get the experience of working with wildlife, handling live animals, and learning all of the things that you need to go through to be able to do that in a safe way, and a way that's also going to teach you something about the animal itself. Oftentimes these students are uh, finishing up their junior year and going into their senior year, so this type of independent research over the summer is pretty ideal for them to uh, turn into a capstone project as they move into their final year. I think a lot of them realize that having that kind of experience doing research, particularly if they want to work outdoors and want to work uh, doing ecology or uh, uh, some form of environmental science, that that experience working with wildlife and being sort of a part of a summer program is a really good thing. So whether they're thinking about going on to graduate school or they're thinking about becoming some sort of field technician with one of the agencies or organizations that does field research, having that experience, having done research, is, is really a big benefit for them. I have prospective students ask me often, what is it about Pacific that's really interesting or unique? And I have to tell them that from my own perspective and talking with other faculty members around here, it's really the personal attention that we provide. So that personal attention, I think, is one of the hallmarks of uh, education at Pacific University.